we have taken so many steps in order to ensure free violence election in the three states. We held several meetings with the leaders of the party at various, at all levels. And also we had discussion with the relevant stakeholders for free and fair election and for violent free election. So I would like to seize this opportunity to remind our members, warn our members that Mr. President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, Bola Ahmed Tinubu, has already told us what matters to him is free and fair election, not the result of the election as such. So we have to abide by that. Even though we know those who are contesting and the party itself, we are all meant to win election, but we should win election in a very judicial a way and as according to the laid down uh, laws and regulations. So I call upon all our members to take note of this so that uh, they, they stick to the tenets of, of the election. Yeah. And another thing that I would like to advise, you see, this issue of uh, town hall considering election matters and security uh, issues should not be adjusted uh, before the election. It should be part of our political culture to have very strong political parties, parties that can be that uh, followers can respect their leaders. But if we have all sorts of political parties with all sorts of uh, kind of uh, structures uh, that members don't even respect the leadership of the party, I think we are still in trouble. So the government uh, should encourage the formation of strong political parties was to serve as an institution. Another thing is that uh, all this kind of uh, uh, publicity, uh, taking precaution, discussion of security issues, uh, election matters, should be institutionalized so that it will be all the year round and different uh, you know, uh, elements should be created to ensure that uh, there's adequate publicity right. throughout the year so that people will be committed to election matters. I think that is how we can uh, sustain our democracy.